We are going to fill the paper with a texture. In order to do this, you're gonna use this mixing paper to prepare the students with some color. I would put a little bit of green and a lot of yellow so that it gets to be a nice lighter green color. You don't have to mix it up, just spread it across the paper. It works well if there's a lot of yellow showing. Then you're gonna put the bubble wrap right down on it, bubble side down, and that's how we're going to create this texture. Students did learn about texture last week, so you should review that. Texture is making artwork look like it feels a certain way. So take the bubble wrap, create a print. You can probably use it three or four times, pressing down on the back. I know this is gonna get messy on their fingers. You should have paper towels and baby wipes laid out, and you should definitely be working on a placemat. After you add, your print, you can dip it again if necessary, and I want you to fill the paper with the little texture of dots. This is going to become the tortoise's legs, so it kind of looks like a scaly skin. Take your time, fill the paper. I would recommend you do not keep going over it, because if you go over it a lot of times, then all of a sudden there will be no circles showing at all. When you believe your paper is ready and finished and has a nice texture on it, you can put it on the drying rack and then grab a green piece of paper and do the exact same thing. Good luck, I hope this is fun. Please be neat, take your time and follow your teacher's directions for cleanup.